Okay, so there's a song that I want to do. I wanted a song and every time I sang it, I just felt an overwhelming amount of energy and appreciation and love and praise for the God that I'm serving. So I wrote this song called Magnify. It comes out of Psalm 34. This song will get you on your feet. This song will get your hands raised. Just bananas worship. I wrote the song in 10 minutes. It was just one of those songs that just, just kind of, it just kind of comes to you. I was talk, talking to God in an apartment in North Grand Prairie here in Texas and I said, God, I need an up-tempo song. He gave me a really good slow song and I need an up-tempo song now. I went in the shower and just started humming a tune. I didn't play keys back then either, so I don't know where it came from, but I got on a keyboard, you know, and just kind of figured out something, had some basic chords. My friends will laugh at me. Caleb, I know you're watching. Anyway, I wanted to find a song that was somewhere between Byron Cage's uh, I Will Bless the Lord and uh, Israel Houghton's uh, Lord You Are Good. I can sing those two songs at any given time. In fact, my band's tired of it. My singers are tired of it. So I found a song that I could bring both of those two things together. The ultimate goal with this song in my heart was to communicate something that everybody could agree with. God's goodness, about effective witness, you know, just watching God do something absolutely spectacular in your life. And I've been singing this song for five years to myself. It's, it's been a little, y'all need to hear it because I don't want to sing it to myself anymore. I, I want to see people enjoying this song. I cannot wait for you to hear it.